Same day, welcome in person and spelling about the real estate transaction. Suggested that everyone did what they were supposed to and threatened to make sure that none of them did what they were supposed to. Said that I pushed up in the darkest place by not answering my phone over the weekend. They saw me think to not, I, I told you I'm backing out of it. So they saw me thinking not to answer my phone over the weekend. And they said that um, I'm putting them in the darkest place. And that the main reason that you called me yesterday was to have someone make an attack on my car. So yesterday, on my way to the hotel that I checked out of today, they um, lied about a pothole. And I'm actually near it today. So it can be re, um, re reiterated. Like, but they lied about it. And then they tried to give me a tire problem out of nowhere behind something that didn't happen. So they completely made some shit up. When I got here, they had a guy stay with his tire off, fixing it. And um, this is at this next location. So they had, and uh, I noticed that they were trying to give me a tire problem because on the way here, on two separate occasions, they did something that simulated that the vehicle was in a condition it was not. So and then they called me out of nowhere with the realtor. She called, acting like it was so urgent for me to sign something um, in relation to closing. And it had nothing to do with closing. It was an email that I got this morning for an extension. Um, pretty much saying that, you know, the same thing, this is the fourth extension like on the transaction saying that i'll give the um seller until this date you know like to finish the final items or you know it's the the amendment that's what the extension does it, it puts any terms new terms in the amendment so didn't see it i mean um i i didn't sign it she called, she's like, Lacey sent you something. She was like, and she sent it to every email of yours. She was like, and we need you to sign it right away. And it's, it's pretty much the last thing that we need for closing. And I was like, okay, so we're closing today. And she was like, uh, yeah, probably. So she tried to set me, she tried to set me up and she tried to play me stupid. Like every week is an extension, okay? Behind some conditions that really don't even exist. That we're supposed to be able to close without. So, while well, I waste my motherfucking money in hotels and shit, and they know I'm about to go back to Akron, Ohio, and kill. Bitch, please. So, Cursing and spelling, cursing and spelling, cursing and spelling. I try to be the most vicious while I'm not recording. Last night I was recording, so I was able to note a lot of things. This started at about 3.30 a.m. Last night they woke me up at midnight and they kept on till I checked out. They keep saying that if someone finds out, like pretty much these the two details of the day, that they're not going to make the attacks that they want them to make on me. And how desperately they want these people to make these attacks on me and how they're trying to get random people I don't know from nowhere to make attacks on me.